The story behind our bad economy can be tough enough for adults to fully understand. So how do we explain things to our kids? We asked the experts for their top tips on talking to children about the current economic crisis. Banks failing, families losing their homes, their jobs. The headlines are scary enough for adults, but for kids who don't understand what's going on, it can be downright frightening. Kids are alarmed. We're hearing from our teacher advisors around the country and from our readers that they really, the uncertainty is what is affecting them most. We asked the experts at Junior Scholastic, a kid-centric newspaper distributed to schools across the country, how they suggest you talk to your kids about the economy. First, they say it's important to listen, find out what's on their minds. We take our cues from the kids themselves. We listen to them and see where their concerns lie and what they want to know and what they can handle and then go out from there. While you don't want to scare them, be honest about the situation. We can certainly be honest with them and tell them, explain to them the basic principles of the mortgage crisis or how families are losing their homes or parents are worried about their jobs. Reassure them that the family has a plan in place if things go wrong. It's the what if that really unsettles kids. So if they have a contingency plan and they know their parents do, that reassures them a great deal. And allow them to become a part of the solution. That's a, a great um, empowerment tool for kids whether it's helping to clip coupons or to eating at home or taking shorter showers, all of those things, you know, help them really uh, deal with what is an ominous crisis for many people. Lastly, experts say try to look at this time in our history as a teachable moment. Kids uh, can learn from the adversity the country is facing, that they may see Americans at, at in general uh, reassessing their values or seeing that money isn't necessarily the answer to everything. Because what they learn now will stay with them as adults and hopefully help them create a better economic future. Well, experts say one thing that's important is don't try to over explain or force a conversation if your child's not asking questions. After all, you don't want to worry them unnecessarily. Thanks for watching Better.TV. For more stories like the one you just saw, catch the television program Better every weekday. Check your local TV listings to see if Better airs in your city.